啦。Hello, pips, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Fitz Pocket Academy. I kind of like it here.、Um, I do.、Um, I like these lights, and something I noticed as well.、Uh, it's it's a ridiculous thing, but I like it. And it's this this walk along here. Look at this. I like this wood with the ropes. Yeah. I don't know. I just really like it around here. Anyway, <laughs> I like the warm tones of the brick and the woods. That、uh, the woods, the brick, the brick and the woods. <laughs> right. Okay. Anyway,、uh, so what's going on here? There is a member of staff I'd really quite like to hire,、um, and actually keep around for a bit. We have Willow here. We need a little bit more money to be able to employ Willow, but we also have a psychiatry emergency here. Oh, hello. I heard a press.、Um, Yeah, and so she could deal with psychiatry. She could be a psychiatrist for a while,、um, but also she has the general practitioner. Look, there we go. Short temper doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. <laughs> We're going to employ her.、Um, there's definitely a press member around、um, that we need to look out for.、Um, so what I'd like to do, we're going to have to wait for a little bit more money to come in, and then we're going to. Um, yeah, get them in psychiatry. I think. In the meantime, let's get them training San Diamond here as a GP.、Um, this still won't make him as good as a GP as essentially Sandy here,、um, but all the same, we, we probably will. Well, we'll let her stay in here for a bit, but she's going to be our surgeon eventually. So we're, we're keeping Sandy around. I like Sandy, you know, I do like Sandy. Right. Okay, it's them. We're killing, we're killing a lot. So who are we killing? What did you have? Minty condition. <clears throat> so this is. I find this one、um, very odd.、Uh, I've played this level before, and I found that this illness. I kept killing them despite it being very low difficulty.、Um, but I suppose we could do better over here. Um, training them up, so we might have to wait for that. But all the same, it's a very low difficulty illness. This is minty condition as well, but we cured them, so I suppose that's something. Didn't we hear another? What did you have? Dramatic pause. We cured them as well. Probably just bad timing more than anything. Although, doesn't have any. Because <laughs> he was just called Zeke, so I employed him.、Uh, oh yeah, yeah. Well, that's that's why he died, right? That is totally why he died. <laughs>、uh, so I. It's possible there is another press around. Oh, do you know as well? I don't think we have. No, we don't have anybody that can deal with ghosts. No, look, no, we don't. We do not. Interesting. Okay. So we need to get Melissa in training, but we have nobody here with the skills. This is terrible.、Uh, oh yeah, Nigel. I remember. Tires easily, but that's okay. But I think I would like.、Um, I mean, she's really great though. She's expensive. I think we might swap them out.、Um, how expensive? You're nice and cheap to employ. So I think what we're going to do is fire.、Uh, if I lose this job, I'll have to set free all of my swans. Okay. Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what a crying shame. Okay, good.、Um, right, where are we with this? <laughs> What's happening? We've got some GP training going ahead. So I'm looking to build the psychiatry, which is going to be a while. What sort of money am I looking at here? <gasps> no. Oh wow. It's because、um, yeah, I mean, a real basic basic would be much cheaper, but I guess that's that's the direction we're going in. We want to.、Um, I want to try and keep it in level five, on hospital level for a bit,、um, so that we don't have an increase of patients coming in or more difficult illnesses coming in. If we can just keep the hospital level low while we try and sort out our staff a little bit,、uh, make a bit of money. You know,、uh, I think we are making money at the moment, just not a lot. Yeah. Yeah, we are making. We are in a profit area, so it's a good spot to sort of stunt growth for a moment, you know, and just try and sort things out, like some training, building up a little bit of money, so we can do this emergency. Although, oh look, 
we must have got awards. Should we view them? I never view the awards, but it looks like we must have got some. Yeah, and we got some because we got money. Okay, so we can now we can actually now just build the psychiatry. Um, I don't know if it's going to fit anywhere. I might have to just sort of plop it somewhere random like this. Would it fit anywhere? Might just stick it over here, look. So we might plop that there. Now this is going to be treatment only. Which means, I think, is that the diagnostic one? Yeah, sell that. And put one of those over here. We've also probably made this room a little bit hot because it comes with a fireplace. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, let's have a look. Should we put in just a little, just a little one? A little, oh, sweet. There we go. A bit easier to see. Hmm. We could, we could pop in just, just a little one. Over here, maybe. There we go. <laughs> Good. So there's that. Because we're going to want this lady here to become our psychiatrist. For sure. Yeah. Now, I don't know what sort of illnesses how difficult fourth wall problems that could be quite a high problem we might kill a lot of those <laughs> is she ready for training herself she is uh, we might we might kill all of them it's it's a distinct possibility it is a distinct possibility oh look we've killed another one here all we need zeke is for you to be ready and you're not quite not quite there although his little circle is coming around look 65 out of 100 if you keep killing them like this, director's gut, <laughs> chronic stomach ache. If you keep killing them, eventually we'll be able to train you. We're all excited for that. <gasps> right, hold the phone. <laughs> okay, just stop a minute. This is why you constantly checking the staff. Very important thing to do. So we've got some... Now, lazy wants more frequent breaks, but otherwise good ward person and i mean steve's not terrible to be fair um but look look at this look at this okay i mean hannah is fantastic she's cheap as well so i think we're going to have to get hannah in um we're gonna have to get hannah in it's ridiculous not to um so i might now fire steve and then Hannah can go in the inverse, right? So we've got that going on. Now, we've also got this nurse here. I'm not going to get Bella or Belle. I'm not going to get them. So, but I'm thinking this Luna here might be worth getting in. Let's have a look at nurses. So, diagnostic nurse. To be honest, this is not terrible for a diagnostic nurse. In fact, none of these nurses are terrible. Um, emotional intelligence probably don't need probably don't need that is it worth me I don't know I don't know I so I don't want to employ her for her to be doing nothing at the moment although we could build another di nurse diagnostic room soon and have her doing diagnostics do you know what I think we might do that so we'll we'll prep for another diagnostic room coming for a nurse that's what we'll do. Um, yeah. I think we'll do that. What else have we got in the old hire area? God, this is nice, isn't it? This is nice. But expensive. Expensive. Um, not really interested in ass assistance anymore. Oh, hello. Likes to argue, but has potential and will work for peanuts. I mean, you can't be ignoring that. So what have we got going on in terms of doctors? So what do we think? Maybe another GP? Maybe another GP. Or a psychiatrist. <gasps> oh my god, a psychiatrist. You can be a psychiatrist. That's what you're going to be. Now, we've just popped up a level, which is not something I want. Not something I want at all. But we, once we've trained them in psychiatry, we can sack Willow. And then that will bring us back down, I would have thought. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, publicity update. Uh, Zara says her guest hasn't mentioned... Oh, goodness oh my goodness are you for real right now <laughs> are you for real right now 
<clears throat> okay. If we got rid of that. No, that didn't bring us down a level. Never mind. Fail treatment over here. That's okay. That is okay. We just want you to be ready for training, Zeke. Yeah, and then... And then what we can do is train you in pharmacy. I'd like to do that. We've got no way of dealing with these ghosts. <laughs> no way of dealing with these ghosts. Ooh, but what we can do is train. So we are now going to train you in psychiatry. And then we will fire Willow. Yes, we will. That's what we'll do. And as the items didn't make much of an impact at all, I feel... Like it might be worth us putting them back in um, so yeah we have this one which I actually think I'm gonna put back over here um, and this is the one that we oh do you know what Jasmine might like that Let's shove that in there how oh my god how expensive was that <laughs> how expensive was that don't know can't afford it oh my goodness oh my goodness <laughs> I should look at the price of these 11 grand all right okay right stop <laughs> get rid of that <laughs> 11 grand uh n not right now let's let's <laughs> this one we'll stick with what we had okay right <laughs> what is this okay henry jobsworth oh he was happy with it excellent well oh, i like that i'm pleased with this that's great. And this training is coming along nicely. What is this? No. Absolutely not. Okay, so we've got a diagnostic. Uh, we haven't quite managed to diagnose this. We're at about 50%. Um, I'm assuming he's been to cardio. Let's have uh, a look. These, this log has got so slow. Can we see the log? No, no, doesn't appear we can see the log. Interesting. Uh, <laughs> well, get rid of Pan's lab. He's been called in. Okay, fine. I'd really like to see the log. We can't. Uh, I was thinking now might be a good opportunity to put in a second diagnostic room. I was thinking it, I might get an idea of how well he was diagnosing this one, but apparently not. Um, let's see here. Oh my god, this is quite expensive. It says 21. We don't have 21. We can't afford that. That's a lie. Um, that is actually a straight up lie. We can't afford it. Um, we might actually have to stick it in over here until we can open up more space. Hmm. Art review. Yes, please do uh, come along for the art review. We'd like one of those. But at least, because they're starting to come in. They are starting to come in. So it would be nice to try and deal with them. Get patient to wait. Is that another one? What one was that? For this. Do you know what? I might send some of these home. I think I might send them home for the moment. He's going to be coming in. I'm going to send home the writer's block. Oh my god, that one. He, the log actually showed up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the log actually showed up. Um, get rid of that. I've decided. I've made an executive decision, everybody. Um, now the training's done. Look at that. The training is done. So we can now fire you excellent what have we got going on here still no ghosty things not really interested in anything here no no okay all right good so we can try this psychiatry one i think it's going to blow up in our face quite honestly i think it probably is i i think they're going to be too difficult do think they're going to be too difficult but you know we'll give it a go we'll see we'll see where it gets us i don't want the pans guys no 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 pan 
No pans. Uh, what is this? Ah, <clears throat> so this is the one that's coming in, right? A condition first recognised um, by the celebrated, now infamous, psychiatrist Ebenezer Forthall. Uh, the sufferer can't tell reality from fantasy or stage left from stage right, caused by hidden cameras, pranks, <laughs> and having one's reality, one's reality totally shattered. Extreme cases have been known to lead sufferer to lead sufferers to believe that they're in some kind of extravagant simulation. Uh, I like it, even though I had trouble reading it for some reason. Look at this. Yeah, see, look how difficult that is. Oh my god, we're gonna kill them all. We're gonna kill them all. <laughs> we're gonna kill them all. Oh, hey. <laughs> Hello, welcome. <laughs> Thanks for turning up. Yeah, so they're all gonna die. Straight up. We know this. It's totally gonna happen. <laughs> but lots of experience towards his next level so that we can get him up to psychiatry too. I mean, that'll be good. Uh, but yeah, he does not have the skills to deal with this. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? Um, <clears throat> she's invited a friend. Do you know what? I'm not bothered now. I've done that. What? <laughs> we, we cured him? <laughs> okay, cool. That's that's pretty cool. Oh, well, that was luck more than judgment. <laughs> I just didn't want to deal with rights block. I don't want to deal with you either. Have you been called in? You have. No. No, turtle head. I don't want you here. I'm not building clinics. It's not happening. Get, get out. Aussie. Get out, Aussie. Get out. Who are you? Which one are you? You're the GP, okay. The thing is, is that Sandy is actually quite a good GP uh, with things as they currently are. Um, we've got a researcher. Interesting. I don't want to build research at the moment because I want to try and keep this in, in five. <gasps> Look at this. Right, hang on a minute. The thing is, is that I really don't want to replace Zeke. <laughs> We don't want to replace Zeke. Uh, let's see here. What have we got? So. Now, she's got some diagnostic training. Where does she work? Okay, she works in diagnostics. So that works. That works for us, right? Hmm. That does kind of work for us. <clears throat> she's nasty and likes to argue. So that solves that one. Look, we've got this treatment nurse, which would be good to replace Zeke with. I just don't want to. Um, yeah. But really good. It's like, I can't really afford Bert, but at the same time, they're sort of too good to let go right now. The staff's been such a problem. They have been such a problem. Do you know what? We'll, we'll shove him... Actually, no, because I want Zeke to get the experience. Yeah. Interesting. So, probably going to be a clinic thing. Uh, even though we're not quite ready for clinics just at the moment. Not interested in this lot. Um, we're going to get rid of these guys just so we can keep that coming. Just in case somebody with, with some sort of ghost uh, training becomes available, you know. Just got to keep a really close eye on staff all the time, you know, um, so that we can make sure that we get, you know, people that we like, people we're happy with. Okay, who was that? Was that was that you? Was that you? Was it? Was it you, Ace Nemesis? Yes, get out. Get out. Oh, hey, Roderick. Okay, no need to barge. I need to barge. Trellis. Get the patient to wait. Who are they? Where are they? You. Interesting. Okay. Don't really have enough room at the moment to build more diagnostics. Having a look at the, the setup here. I suppose I'm interested in this building here. Not this one. Probably won't get this one. But I'm interested in this one. And this one, I think. Um, so I'd like... Yeah, this will allow for more diagnosis space, which I'm definitely into. So, uh, banging headache, excellent. 
That is now in the house. We've added it to our repertoire. Oh my god, look at this one. <laughs> Alright, Finley. <laughs> Uh, amazing. What is this? Art review. Ooh, look at that. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Cool. Okay. Um, how have we been doing with this? We've cured three so far. Wow. How's he done that? Seriously. I feel like the it's all out of whack. We've got an easy illness, which we kill all the time. And in a difficult illness, we are curing more than we're failing. I don't understand that. What is going on? It feels like things are just slightly out of whack on this level. <laughs> um, how much are we saving up for this plot? 35. Okay. Fair enough. That's fair enough. I don't want you. I see you. You, sir. Go home. Thank you. Did we just... We failed that one. Okay. That makes more sense, to be honest. We should have failed more... Even if we break even, I'm going to be gobsmacked. Do you know what I mean? Absolutely gobsmacked. How's he doing? Yeah, he's doing all right for the old energy and whatnot. What is this? Pest control? No. Send patient home. I'm not building pest control. I'm not doing it. Which is, uh, we'll worry about this later. Uh, staff is my main concern at the moment. Right, do I spend all of our money? Yes. That's exactly what I do. That is exactly what I'm going to do. We've opened up this space so that we can look at diagnostics. Um, a bit more seriously um, I like that and this is because this is treatment this ward here we've got as treatment and looking at the bed situation we might be able to open this up to diagnostics as well do you know what I might do that what is this um, get patients away I'd like to see what illness that is oh my god look okay well do you know what that was really good well done mate well done so who have we had who have we made wait where are they? Who's waiting? Is it you? No. Who's... We, we made somebody wait, so now I don't know who they are. It, they should come up above their head. <laughs> it's not. It's not. It's freaking me out. Uh, Alright. <laughs> um, excellent. Okay. Alright. Roderick's having a look around. Uh, I'm keen to get another diagnostic room in. I need to have a bit of a rearrange with this space. Bearing in mind that I will be unlocking this at some point as well. Because um, we're going to want to get a nice flow. Di di uh, GP into diagnostics, right? That's, that's what we're going to do here. No yeah. Okay. That's what we need to do. Just move the ward. Cause a bit of ruckus. Uh, but just uh, trying to have a bit of a workout <coughs> of, this, of this space. Um, you know kind of keen to figure it out uh, and I think looking at it we're going to put um, it's gonna push us over into level six and I think it's just something we're going to have to do um, let's see here because I'd like to get this in I do kind of wish um, actually do you know what that that might be fine just like on the reverse would be good, you know, the other way around. <clears throat> but there we are. But if I put it there, I could always have a little seating area and stuff here. That might be okay. I mean, that might be okay, right? Ooh. In Bagneto. Oh, okay. Excellent. We know exactly which one that is. <laughs> uh, I like that. Good. Oh, you though can go. We don't want you around these parts. Definitely not. Um, and then this gives us the opportunity to put in general diagnosis here. Um, so with that plan in mind, knowing that that's what's going to be going in here, uh, what we might do is pop some bennies in there. Um, <clears throat> and actually, maybe we shouldn't put it there. Maybe we should sort of put it over here somewhere. Give ourselves another sort of seating area over here. That might be good. You know. Yeah, I think. We'll just put one Benny outside here, I think. 
Yeah. Okay, so they are going to need some food and drink in this area. Um, do I pop it over here? It's a bit tucked away, whereas it's a bit more widely available over here. So I think we might... These are expensive, those. These ones. Yeah, see, look. How much is the binny? Can we get the binny in? Um, I don't want to put the binny where the seating is. So we might just stick that there. There we go. So we need to get some entertainment in over here. Um, and some paintings. But we're just starting to develop a diagnostic area. Um, now while this does treatment at the moment, we can totally sort that out later. We can always see about putting in a smaller toilet, custom made one. Writer's block has now been discovered. Uh, the benefit of getting in some additional diagnosis and we've got the nurse to do it as well which is fantastic um so he'd like to learn any qualification we'll have a look at that uh so who is he ah okay let's see assistance ooh who's cheaper you by by a very small amount what we might do then is employ them and then train him in customer service too. That's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. You can go. We are going to have to look at the clinics in order to deal with this. Um, but I just, it's its not about that right now. It's, it's about getting a strong foundation for the hospital moving forwards. And just sorting out the staff and being happy with what we have, you know. Uh, much more important at this moment in time um so very keen to get some entertainment over here um i think mind you these are grand each so maybe we won't do that maybe we'll grab some magazines over here um and yeah these as well good like that bit of entertainment I like it I like it we could also shove in a water cooler look at that nice excellent um nice okay nice I I'm thinking like a bubble gum machine might be nice here <laughs> for some reason oh no what do they call it let's try gum yeah okay Yes. Good. Uh, so I'm thinking a small custom toilet. If we can, around this space might be nice. Can't be one. But that's what I'm thinking here. Um, so not using one of these designs. You know? Oh, you really need to deal with this. Oh, you can go home though. That's you dealt with. Oh no, look. I like that they're actually called Sandy Screen. <laughs> Let's put you further down the queue and then we can send you home. There we go. Excellent. There we go. A little pokey toilet. <laughs> Serves the purpose. Uh, do we have a nice smelling... Oh no, we moved this. So we probably lost it. That's fine. Um, we want a nice smelling... We don't have a lot of money. I'm always uh, <laughs> right on the edge here. There we go. I think that's nice. I think that's nice. Do you know what? My... Actually, some more entertainment here might be good. You know, and we're gonna we're gonna go cheap entertainment for the moment. But we might want to upgrade this later, given given the nature of uh, where we are. You know, uh, good. The war room required. Oh yes, we've discovered private parts. <laughs> Excellent. So this is probably one we are going to want to build. Um, the body has been invaded by a hostile part polymer parasite. Sufferers exhibit a monochromatic green exterior and extremely limited flexibility. They'll soldier on until they freeze in pose, but they need to be melted down, uh, strained and reset if they ever want to regain regular rigidity. Excellent. Um, don't think I can build that just at the moment. He oh he learned his qualification right hang on a second so let's let's deal with that first um so assistance so we're now going to fire you um how is everybody wage wise 
they are fine that's good pleased about that um look at the queue um it's possible as well that we've got some people we can send away you are one um you are another we might have some press in there as well now the private parts i'm assuming uh, i shouldn't assume let's just have a quick look yeah i was thinking i'm probably gonna have to research it um yeah yeah and no, i do i do so for the time being we are going to send them home and know that research is now on the list of things that we need to deal with um probably going to be a star two objective i would have thought um uh, that's fine deal with those right i definitely heard definitely heard some flashing it's got to be in the queue here isn't it come on oh no he's seeing them all into the hospital come on there's bound to be some press here no surely uh oh get rid of them there's bound to be some press here no really i find that shocking I find that short. Sh surgery. Surgery required. Now, of course, we do have. Get patient to wait. We do have a really decent surgeon. Can't afford to build surgery, though. Interesting. Health inspection? Sure. <laughs> this is the problem with being in level six. It's growing just a little bit faster than I'd like right now. We might have to send you home. But it's good to know. So we've got research. I swear I can hear somebody over here. We've got research and surgery on the list of things I'm very keen to build. Um, I swear we've got more press over here. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you to all my Patreons for their continued support.